guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. I'm Natalie, and today we are finally watching Doctor Strange in the Multiverse of Madness. Welcome back to my channel, everyone. Thank you so much for being here, especially you. Yes, you. Hello, you. Thank you to all of you guys who subscribe, who stick around and watch these videos with me on a regular basis. It means so much to see your comments down below on these movies and shows, and y'all make this community so fun to be a part of, so thank you for subscribing. And welcome if you're new. Hey, hi, how are ya? If you like what you see here and you enjoy these kinds of videos, maybe consider clicking the little red button down below to subscribe. It's free, and I would love to have you here. It's finally time for another Marvel movie, one with Doctor Strange, and I also know that Wanda is in this movie. I'm super excited to see Elizabeth Olsen again. I think she's incredible as Wanda. I loved her in WandaVision. I think she demonstrates a real sensitive vulnerability while still having this strength to her that makes her really compelling to watch. It's the same reason I kind of really enjoy watching Scarlett Johansson. They both kind of wear their hearts on their sleeves, but also know how to kind of stay guarded in a way that the character would stay guarded, but still not guarding their emotions from us as an audience member or a viewer, if that makes sense. I think they both do a really great job demonstrating vulnerability in their performances, and um, I think they're both awesome. So I'm really excited to see her again with a title like Multiverse of Madness. I'm assuming that it's kind of similar to Spider-Man No Way Home, where uh, we were ripping the fabric of our universe and our reality and other universes and realities were colliding um, and kind of overlapping in confusing ways. I feel like uh, that must be what's going on in this movie. Also, I did see the teaser trailer. I didn't see the full trailer, actually. I, me I kept meaning to watch it and do a trailer reaction to the full trailer. I actually never got around to it, so I'm going into this one more blind than I would have. But I did see the teaser that was at the end of, I believe, No Way Home, or maybe it was at the end of Moon Knight. I can't really remember. And I do remember seeing an evil version of Doctor Strange in that movie, so I know we're gonna be getting that. I think we also saw Chiwetel Ejiofor in that teaser as well, which does make sense. We always knew he was gonna come back around and be a villain or a foe to Benedict Cumberbatch's character, so I'm expecting to see that in this movie. Uh, I love him too, he's an incredible actor, so I'm excited to see him again. Maybe we'll see Rachel McAdams again. I think I think she's here on the cover. It's kind of hard to tell, because she's little. Um, she might be here on the cover of the movie, so wouldn't be surprised if we see her as well. It just seems like it's gonna be a lot of familiar faces and a lot of different actors and characters in this movie, but mainly I'm excited to see Wanda. I'm not gonna lie, she's definitely one of my favorites. Characters, love her. I've really truly never been a big fan of Doctor Strange as a character. I think he's very powerful, but I just hated his origin story. Like, I didn't sympathize with him at all in the first movie. I thought he deserved to go through the dark night of the soul moment that he went through in the whole first half of the film because he was he was a jackass. He was driving recklessly, texting and driving. He was, he was a tool. Um, <laughs> and he needed to go through all of that to be humbled and become a better person. And he is a better person now. But um, I know some people find that kind of stuff compelling. But for me, I've just never really liked him as a character. I think Benedict Cumberbatch as an actor is awesome. I think he makes really strong choices. And I, I do like his work. And the interviews that I've seen him do, he just seems like a great dude as well. But the character Doctor Strange, I just find frustrating. So I'm actually interested to see if this movie changes my mind at all, because so far, um, especially with Spider-Man No Way Home as well, I think Doctor Strange was making dumb decisions. And granted, those decisions were like the basis for the whole story of Spider-Man No Way Home. And if he hadn't made them, that movie couldn't have existed. But I just think the whole decision to like ignore Wong's concerns and like open dimensions and f alter the past and time to uh, make Peter happy and help him and his friends get into college. Like, I just think that whole thing was so stupid and reckless and a man as smart as Doctor Strange should have known better. I just don't think he's a great character, if I'm being honest. I mean, he's a compelling character or whatever. I just don't like him. I think he's annoying. Um, maybe that's a hot take. Maybe y'all are gonna hate me for that, but I gotta be honest about how I feel about some of these characters. Most of the characters I generally like. Doctor Strange ain't one of them, so 
It doesn't mean that I think the movies are bad because I did like the first movie. I think the effects were incredible in the first film. I think the story was really interesting, but I just didn't empathize with him a lot as a character. And that's my thing. Like I'm a very character driven person. I like it when I can empathize with characters a lot. Yeah, maybe this movie will change my mind. I would, I'm open to it. I would love to uh, like Doctor Strange a little more than I do. But I love Wanda, so I'm really here for Wanda at this point in time, but maybe by the end of the movie, I will feel differently. Maybe the title of this video will be like, hot take, Doctor Strange sucks, change my mind. <laughs> I'm gonna upset some people with this one, huh? I think it'll be a fun time. I think it'll be a wild ride, and I'm excited to hop on into it. And with all that being said, I think it's time to watch this movie. So if you guys are ready, grab a drink, grab a snack, and let's get into Doctor Strange. Okay, what is happening? Who is this girl with this jean jacket? Oh, is this a different Doctor Strange? Look at his hair, he's got a gray streak. You can't let it take your power. Get to the book. Her power? What power? Why can't we let it take her power? Oh, f what is this thing? Oh no, is there any way you can get across? Uh-oh. I'm so sorry. This is the only way. He's gonna kill her? Is he gonna kill her? I can't let that thing take your power. Yeah. You can't control it. He's killing her? But I can. Oh, he's taking her power? You're killing me! I know, but in the grand calculus of the multiverse, your sacrifice is worth more than your life. Doesn't matter, he killed him. Get the book, is it possible? Oh, good job. Oh, star power, look at her. She create little portals and Oh, he cut her, he cut her free. Oh wow, what a dream. Damn, what a sophisticated bedroom you have. Oh, he's got two gray streaks too, but they're just in different places. I never noticed that before. That's interesting. Oh, the watch, the watch. Are you at a wedding? Whose wedding is it? Why do I feel like it's Rachel getting married to somebody else? Does she not have anyone to walk her down the aisle? Oh, that's sad. I'm surprised he came, to be honest. I mean, maybe he just wants to stay friends with her, but I'm so surprised he would come to this. I feel like this would be so painful. Glass of red, please. Allow me, miss. Mm. Showing, showing off, show off. Honestly, wearing, drinking red wine while you're wearing a white dress is such a bold move. I'm not gonna be doing that at my wedding. I, don't, I love red wine, but I don't trust myself. I wish it had been different. I never stop caring about Oh, you at her wedding, dude? You're doing this at her wedding. It was never gonna work out between us. This is such a weird conversation to be having here at her wedding. Truly, I'm just glad that you're happy. Uh-huh, you look so glad. I really, really am. Yeah. Are you? No. <laughs> no. <laughs> I don't think he is. He's pining for you, ma'am. I don't blame him, you're, you look incredible. No, ma'am. Oh no. What? On her wedding day? What's going on? Finish your drink and go save the day. Yep. He's such a show off. Uh, he's such a show off. We had to. Uh, oh my god. What the f is happening? What was that? What is happening? Oh, it's that girl. Oh, right. That girl. I love how all these people are st always stand by and watch. They don't run away. Oh, it's his dream. He remembers her. Yeah, it wasn't a dream. It was just you in a different reality. What is this thing though? Is it another version of the thing that was hunting her down in the other realm or something? Ew, it's so gross. Well, she runs really fast. Uh-oh, not fast enough though. <laughs> Wong, hey, what's up? Yo, yo, Doctor Strange, wakey, wakey. Thank you, Cape. Thank you, Cape. <laughs> That's exactly what I was thinking. So is this girl's power like time travel, dimension, interdimensional travel? Like what is her power? This movie was totally made for 3D, huh? I feel like this movie was meant to be viewed in 3D. Oh my God, no! Oh, thank God. Thank God there was a ledge there. Oh, the cape, the poor cape. Ow. Oh, okay guys, everybody evacuate the building. I feel like if you hear screaming in New York in this world, after all the alien invasions and shit that people have been through here, like if I heard screaming, I'd be like, we're just gonna evacuate. Like these people right now, I'd be like, we're evacuating right now. That's incredible. Yeah. Yeah, why aren't you all running? 
That thing could get to your building in 2.5 seconds. Go home. Wedding's over. Christine just looks embarrassed. <laughs> it's like, this is a life-threatening situation. Ew, 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 ew. Oh, that's really gross. Ah! That wasn't a dream. Uh. It was another universe. She knows. How does she know? I can travel the multiverse. Ah. Uh. Only happens when I'm really, really afraid. Oh. You guys knew of this magical book of pure good that gives a sorcerer whatever they need to defeat their enemy. The book of Vashanti? It's a fairy tale that doesn't exist. Actually, it does. See, Wong is smarter. That wasn't a dream. Proven. Oh, sh he did. Oh, because he came through with her. Right. That's creepy to see that when it's like your body. That's scary. That means dreams and windows into the lives of our multiversal selves. Well, sh man, because I've been having some stress dreams about the wedding. Somewhere out there, I had a ponytail. Right, you did have a ponytail. Your hair does look better in this universe, I'm not gonna lie. What do we do with him? Yeah, what do you do? You're burying him here? Is this land? What the f That's gotta violate an ordinance. Yeah, for sure. Isn't it gonna smell? It's witchcraft. Do we know anyone who's faced such a thing? We do. Ah, the theme! <laughs> Hello, Wanda. Hey, what did I say? Oh my God, her kids. We could never truly leave each other, even if we tried. Mom, I changed my mind. You can come talk to me here if you want. <laughs> Don't make me cry again, please. <gasps> oh, her, that was her dream. Oh God, please. I Ah, that sharp cut. Oh my God. The sound design with it being silent makes it so sad. Apples, right? Eventually. She's not even phased that he's here. <laughs> she sends him coming. What if you brought America here? Here? Yeah, I know what it's like to be on your own, hunted for abilities you never wanted. You never told me her name, did you? No. Oh, oh, how did you? You know, the hex was the easy part. Uh-oh. The lying, not so much. It's all fake. Oh, the lying about not doing magic. It's all fake. Oh, oh, damn. She's a Scarlet Witch. Yeah. Yeah, because I was going to say at the end of WandaVision, she was practicing magic like hella crazy. So this does make more sense. Wow. Holy f She fooled him. I'm going to leave this reality and go to one where I can be with my children. Oh, honey, your children aren't real. She hopes there's a real version of them out there somewhere. If you knew there was a universe where you were happy, wouldn't you want to go there? Of course he would, with Christine, of course. Uh, <sighs> you break the rules and become a hero. Yeah. I do it and I become the enemy. Yeah, well you're, uh, Wanda, when you broke the rules, you manipulated a bunch of people into acting in your show. <laughs> Although I, I understand why she's bitter. And if we don't? Then it won't be Wanda who comes for her. It will be the Scarlet Witch. Well, damn. I didn't realize that Wanda was gonna be like working against Steven in this, holy f I thought they were gonna be working together. So the person you went to ask for help and told exactly where I am. Yeah. Is the person that's trying to kill me. Yeah, honey, we just gotta make you scared so you jump to another dimension again. Don't we just need to make America scared so she can time jump again, like go to a different dimension? Wouldn't that be the best option? Like, why are we gonna fight Wanda? Shouldn't we just try to get America out of here, like make her scared so she can star the hole can open again? Feels like the simpler solution. Oh, fun. That's not terrifying at all. There she is. Hi. You know, I hate to say it, but I kind of agree, I feel like right now with the last Doctor Strange in the last universe who was like, the, the only answer is like, you have to die, America, because like she, Wanda's not gonna give up chasing this power. Oh, bye-bye. I mean, maybe she will by the end. I can't, oh. Damn, it's like Pompeii in here. Mother, okay. All right, Wanda. Wanda's character progression is really interesting. She's one of the few people who like went from like villain to hero to villain again, you know? Uh oh. It's a fun little sound effect that she has. Reflections. Reflections. She's using the reflections. Cover them. Well, why is there just water on the ground? If she's using the reflections, why is there so much water on the ground? Ma'am. <laughs> 
I love how she I love how she took a moment to stare into the puddle. <laughs> like, why? What are you doing? Oh my god, what the f What the f Wanda, you have no children. They don't exist. Oh, but they do. In every other universe. How do you know that? Because I dream of them. Oh. Every night. Are dreams always what's happening in another multiverse though? Like, why, why can't sometimes it just be like a memory? Are you hissing? What? Really? <laughs> I'm sorry, some of the some of the style of how things are being executed is kind of silly to me. Oh, oh no, Wong, he's gotten knocked out. Oh, bye-bye, America. We're sorry. Oh yeah, she's scared, so she formed it. Oh, they're both they both went through. Where are you guys gonna end up? Holy <laughs> Dinosaurs! Cartoons! Is it just until she stops being afraid? Mike, ow! Where the f are you guys? So, this is New York in the multiverse. Is it? Are you throw up? Yep. Honestly, this New York is dope with the greenery everywhere. Oh, that's cute. Ugh. I want to go to this New York. This is way better. Look at this. Shit. This is awesome. It's like Singapore. Well, what about this universe's version of you? Maybe she could control her powers. This universe doesn't have a me. None of them do. None of them do? Wow. I'm not, I'm going to say, I think it's a little on the nose that her jacket is red, white, and blue with stars and her name is America and her, her portals are shaped like stars. Like is, I get that that's probably from the comic books, but it's a little on the nose. Memory lane. Replay your significant memories now at a discounted price. Wow. Wow. What a, what a crazy invention. Oh, she's a little kid. This is her home planet. Home. Yeah. My mom's. Aww. What? Oh, that's when she first got zapped away. Oh, her mom's. Oh, she didn't get zapped away. Her mom's did. Oh, no, she did too. Did she get separated from them? Man, that would just make me really scared of bees after that. <laughs> Trauma. Oh, the strange museum. If, why is there a museum here for him? Gave his life defeating the, oh, he's dead. That makes sense. If other you's dead, who's master of the sanctum? Other Wong? Or is it Chiwetel Ejiofor? Because we got to see him. Ah, it's totally Chiwetel! What's his character name again? I forget. Yeah, Mordo. Mordo. That's his name. And then he snapped and dedicated his life to trying to kill me. But this is other Mordo. Because you always suspected this day would come. Is he going to hug him? My brother. <laughs> see, he likes him here. Oh, it's... Oh, good. You guys have a good relationship. Come in. Wait, the, oh, the closed captions call him 838 Mordo. I guess the name of this universe is 838. There is a spell contained within those pages, corrosive to the soul. Uh-oh, spooky. Dreamwalking. Dreamwalking. Projects their own consciousness from their universe into another. Oh. Possessing the body of an alternate self. Oh, Jesus Christ. So she could control another Wanda or somebody else in this universe? It's interesting that her fingertips have gone black. It's like she's dying the more time, the more often she does this dark old magic. What do you know of the Book of Ashanti? I need your help to get me to it. Whoa. Uh-oh, what's happening? What's happening? I'm sorry, Stephen. Uh-oh. But it is not Mordo. Maximoff who threatens our reality. It's him? It's the two of you. What? Did they get drugged? They got drugged. She's coming. I gotta say the style for this movie is so wacky. It's like, keeps throwing me off. The editing transitions and techniques they're using are like kind of all over the place. It doesn't feel very grounded. It feels like it's kind of wacky and comedic, but the movie's not comedic, so I'm confused. Is this her dreamwalking? She trying to invade her? Uh-oh, that's terrifying. Whoa, that's cool. Although terrifying. Oh, that's terrifying as well. Wanda really could just like have her own horror movie. Uh oh. Oh, there she is. Start. I want to start. I want to start. Why don't you both start it? Whatever it is. She's crying. Oh God, she's crying. It's interesting that she chose to do this when she knows that this version of Wanda has to take care of her sons. I need to just start the book. No. What? It cannot be you. Oh, she's gonna try to do it. I mean, nice try, love. Wait, did it work? 
Oh, wow, that is horrific. Holy f Sarah, you really should have set Wong free before you, you did that. <laughs> oh no. Tell me what you know. You have to kill me, witch. Not you, them. Oh, she's raising them all from the dead? Wow, wonderful. Or maybe they're alive, but just barely, and she's torturing them. The dark hole wants a copy! Oh, really, Wong? Really, Wong? Oh, wow, he just, he imprisoned them. Interesting. These situations don't usually work out well for the nameless scientists, so just... What? Christine? Oh, Stephen. What? Adios. Adios mio. <laughs> or in my words, oy vez mia. <laughs> the two of you, along with your sentient cloak, are here for surveillance and testing. I thought you were a nurse, ma'am. Oh, because it's a different universe, right. She's a scientist here. Holy f Maybe this is the Christine you're supposed to end up with. Look, Doctor Strange here is dead. Uh, what were we to each other in this universe? We never quite figured that out. Oh, interesting. Similar. So I don't care if you're from the Avengers or S.H.I.E.L.D. We're neither. Oh, look at all these robots. These robots look like Ultron, kind of. Like the face. The Illuminati. We'll see you now. Uh, 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 what? What? Uh, 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 <laughs> the Illuminati! <laughs> the Illuminati will see you now! What the f is this movie? <laughs> what the f <laughs> Guys, what? I'm sorry. What the f is happening? Eons ago, the first demon, Sir Thorn, carved his dark magic into this tomb. Oh, fun. Oh, there be ghosts here, huh? A little poltergeist action? This really is like a like a horror movie combined with like an action movie combined with like something else. Wacky comedy? I don't know. It's not funny. It's just like the editing is weird. Oh, God. They all have red eyes like her. Oh, they're bowing to her? Oh, because she's the Scarlet Witch. Oh, damn. They've been waiting for me. Oh, fun. Little horrific prophecy action. Oh, look, it's her. Hey. This isn't a tomb. It's a shrine? What is it? It's a throne. Oh, a throne. Oh, fun. Fun, fun. Oh, look, yes, the Illuminati's headquarters. Who's in charge of the Illuminati? Let's see. You are now called before the Illuminati. Did I see an Avenger shield? Like a Captain America shield? Captain Carter, the first Avenger. Oh, the Illuminati are the Avengers here. Reed Richards of the- fa Hey! Oh, the Fantastic Four. Steven, your arrival here confuses and destabilizes reality. What the f is happening? This is crazy. My, my brain can't handle seeing Jim from The Office as a superhero. <laughs> from our experience, the greatest danger to the multiverse, it turns out, is Doctor Strange. You're Doctor Strange? Earth's mightiest hero who died defeating Thanos? We should tell him the truth. Yeah, there's gotta be an evil Doctor Strange. What? Charles? What? Professor Charles Xavier. <laughs> What the f is that's not how our strange died Y'all what is a uh, what uh, just uh, okay. All right. Okay. There are worlds where you are together. Is that not enough? Yeah. No. Oh Wong <laughs> Okay Wong gotta be alive, right? Like, there's no way that he just died like that so quickly. She dream walking again? Oh, fun. We're just leaving your kids home without a babysitter? Wanda, it's not a very good mother. We were at war while the rest <gasps> of us banded together to try to stop that. Oh, it's a lie. Oh. He turned to the Darkhold, began dream walking. Oh, he was their Scarlet Witch. You never told us the details of what had happened, only that you had inadvertently triggered an incursion had caused the annihilation of another universe. Stephen renounced the Darkhold's evil and helped us find the Book of Vishanti, a weapon we did use together to defeat Thanos. But one final threat remained. Are we showing him? Oh. Oh, his fingers are black like Wanda's. Oh, and he spoke. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. That's how we killed him, damn. Okay. Uh-oh, Wanda's here. Stephen, should you manage to escape this chamber, you must guide America Chavez. Should you manage to escape it? Charles, we cannot trust him. I believe we can. Should you choose to escape, how about you just let him free then? Damn! 
Ultron Command Shield. Oh, it is Ultron's Ultron head. Okay, cool. Ultron she looks terrifying, covered in blood. My God. Oh my God. Or dirt or whatever she's covered in. My God. Wanna stop. Is she barefoot? She left the house barefoot. Black Bolt could destroy you with one whisper from his mouth. What mouth? Oh no. She's altering reality. <laughs> she just blew his mother brain. Oh, bye bye. Oh, ow. Ew, gross. Oh, bye. Yeah, I, I I think at this point I'd be like, okay, that's fine. You can run. You can. That's fine. I just will let you get to the kid. I guess I don't, I don't know what to do anymore. My vote will conclude these proceedings when they return. They're not gonna return. They're already dead. Half of them are dead. Peggy. Is she running silently. <laughs> of all the people to survive, it's Peggy. Oh, I could do this all day. Yeah, but I feel like you're about to die, Peggy. I'm sorry. Like, she just, she killed the the two men, like, in two seconds. I feel like she's just toying with you. How is this even? Oh, yep. Bye, Peggy. Bye, Peggy. Oh, bye, Peggy. Oh, bleh. And I bet secretly, my brother, you hated me here. You must have been so jealous. You're baiting him into fighting you so you can get out of the cuffs? Bold move, choosing to fight him when you're still cuffed. Oh, they're broken, one's broken, great. Oh. Oh, cute, look at you two. Oh, never mind. Uh-oh, Christine, uh, you don't stand a chance, girly. Oh, she's doing that. Oh, she's trying that. You could have done that? Well, she didn't know she could do it, to be fair. Enough. Oh, hey, Charles. Is she gonna kill him? Oh, they're having a telepathic war? Wow. They're fighting with the minds. Right now, this is kind of reminding me of like that all white scene between Harry Potter and Dumbledore when Harry died. Spoilers, sorry. <laughs> oh, fun. Is that, is that like the, that looks like the rubble from when she. Your mind is being held hostage by your alternate self. Oh, oh, this is the real Wanda. Oh, this is the rubble from when she was a child. The bomb sounds, yeah. Uh-oh, she's too powerful. Did he just die? Really? Wow. Oh, they're gone. She really likes going like, ah! Oh, I can't do it, wait. Do not make me regret this. I won't. Okay, chop chop, we don't really have time. Oh, she's running on broken. Walking on, walking on broken glass. There she is. Honestly, like, I, I want to be this Wanda for Halloween. This is an easy costume. Just cover yourself in dirt, put in some red contacts. What if she gets this Wanda killed? Like, this Wanda's body killed and these children lose their mother. Like, it's just so sad. Warning blast door. Yeah, I'll say. Also, why are we standing here waiting for her to blast through it? That was, that was scary. I will admit that was scary. I don't know why we're standing around waiting for her to show up. The book's through here, but only Steven's ever opened it. Oh, fun. <sighs> a champion this specific to me, something only I would know, come on. Steven. Something Christine would know. <gasps> Is it her jewelry, her watch? Oh, the watch, it's the watch. Wow, good thinking, Christine. Come on, kid, you got this. Hurry up, chop, chop. Maybe close the door behind you, buy yourself another two seconds. Or not, it's fine. Yeah, don't worry, let's just stare at the book forever until Wanda shows up. Oh, that was really scary. That was really scary. Damn. Oh no! She's burning the book. Oh no, she's sending them through it but holding on to America and calming her down. Oh no. Oh, sending America there, I see. I see, but we're not gonna get, are we gonna get other, no, we're not gonna put other Wanda home. She's just gonna wake up here and freak the fuck out. Her boys. Yeah, what about her boys? Is she gonna be able to get home to her boys? Like, damn, man. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Two realities collided. Yep. America doesn't have long. America, honey, it's the world. <laughs> America doesn't have, oh no, wait, right. Oh my God, America's her name. <laughs> I forgot her, was her name. I genuinely forgot that was her name. Yeah, she doesn't have long. Wow. The artwork is, wow. The artwork is cool. Oh, right, because they got sent 
Yeah. Uh, oh, fun. Is this a really evil Doctor Strange? I know we have to meet a really evil Doctor Strange. It's finally time. Whoa. Is that a big, gigantic crescent moon? Stairs leading to supposedly nowhere. That's fun. I suppose your reality wasn't always like this. I suspect it was somewhat like yours until... Until? Until I lost. You lost what? What did you lose? I've been trying to leave this place for a long time. Oh, he's the Scarlet Witch here. He guards the Darkhold here. Maybe not the Scarlet Witch, but he just he just watches over the Darkhold. The Darkhold exacts a heavy toll. Yeah, you look like a f mess, bro. That dream where you're falling as if you've been pushed off a tall building. That was probably me. Jesus Christ, why does he have a third eye? Oh, because he killed it. He pushed off. Oh, fun. He killed a lot of the Stephen Stranges. That's fun. No! This is like a horror, horror flick. What are we doing with the music notes? We're hitting him with the power of music. I love what they did with his eyebrows here. They made him look crazy. What the f We're fighting with classical music? Huh? Gee, yeah. This movie is so weird. Oh, hey, Wong, you gotta be alive somewhere, right? What, Wong? Wong. Oh yeah, America, how are you doing? Oh, not great. It's interesting that she hasn't opened a star portal yet for being afraid. You're going to dreamwalk? All you strangers, you're the same. Well, what the f is he supposed to do, girl? While I'm under, I needed to protect my body in case they attack me for trespassing. Who's they? Yeah, who is they? Souls of the damned. Oh, that's fun. How is she supposed to protect you from the souls of the damned? This is so campy. This whole movie is so campy. But doesn't a version of you need to live in that universe? Who said they had to be living? The dead body. The dead body. Oh my God, this is so, this, oh my God. Ah! <laughs> he, he, it's like Billy in Hocus Pocus. This is hysterical. Oh my God, okay. I'm on board now, because it's just, oh, this is hilarious. Honestly, this movie should have come out for Halloween. This just feels like it was meant to come out around Halloween, you know? I feel like there's gonna be a million Doctor Stranges and Wandas for Halloween. Ooh, oh God, that is a nightmare. Oh, the makeup they had to put on him. Oh, wee, he made a cape, fun. Oh, good job, Wong. Dreamwalking, you hypocrite. Uh huh. Well, you burned hit the the you burned the the good book, so he needed to use the bad book. Damn! She's breaking free. Strange, take America's power. No, that's exactly what she didn't want. She trusted him. There's no other way. Can't you take her power without killing her? It's okay. I understand now. Oh wow, she's very understanding. No, America. Even that led you to this moment. When you're gonna kick that witch's ass. Okay. Oh my god. Oh my. Oh my. <laughs> oh my god. Who directed this? I gotta look at this up, man. Did they do some other kind of campy, like, summer movie? They had to have, huh? Oh, it's all up to you, America. You got it. Oh, ew, 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 ew. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. Uh-huh. Oh, a lot of stars. Oh, there she goes. Oh, is she in her living room right now? Are they seeing her? Really? Oh. Bobby. Bobby! It's the witch! You just ruined her chances. Get away from her! Oh my God, you're gonna kill her and she's their mom. What the f Get away from our mom! You're not our real mom! Yeah, they don't love you. Oh, I, I feel really bad for Wanda, man. It's sad. Please don't hurt us. Please. Yeah, they're scared of you, girl. Yeah, you're not their mother. I know, it's heartbreaking, but you're not. You traumatize them and you wrecked their home and you hurt their mom. She's just really jealous. <laughs> I don't blame her. Oh, she's devastated. This is this is the way to wreck her. Damn. Oh, damn. Not that they'll be loved. Aw, damn. Yeah, this is the only way you stop her. <laughs> What's gonna happen now? What is she gonna do? I opened the dark hold. Is she gonna die now? I have to close it. It has to be closed. So she destroyed the dark hole in every universe. 
Wasn't this universe like kind of create the one that they're standing in kind of created by Stephen Strange, like mastering the Darkhold though and opening it? So wouldn't like this universe start to collapse? I don't know. Maybe not. I love you. Oh. I love you in every universe. It's just, I get scared. <laughs> so what he's saying is in every universe, he's a little Now is this so much harder than the multiversal portal? Ah, can we not find our mothers? Steven, I'm glad I fell into your universe. Aww. So am I, kid. So am I. <laughs> we had to repeat the, so am I, kid. So am I. Is he repairing the watch? Or just changing the battery, I mean. Like, I don't know if he's gonna repair the face. Oh, he is, he's gonna repair the face. Cause he's moving on. I know he like left it stopped on that second where the, where the car crash had happened. So he repaired it. Cause he's finally moving on. Wow. Oh, but he's also putting it away. Interesting. Oh, what's happening to him? What the f Oh my God. It's directed by Sam Raimi. That's why it's so f corny and campy. <laughs> oh, it all makes sense. Oh my God. Oh my God. Well, that, wow, that was not what I was expecting. And it was funny because like for the first like probably two thirds of the movie, I was like, what the f is going on? But by the end, I was like, okay, I get it. This is what we're doing. It just took me a while to like understand that we were being campy with it. Dr. Strange. Who are you? I help you. You caused an incursion. Uh-oh. Oh. Unless you're afraid. Not in the least. Oh, God. The whole third eye thing is terrifying. I don't like that. So there's going to be another movie for sure. Yeah, I figured. <laughs> <laughs> it's over. <laughs> that was actually cute. <laughs> His face just completely covered in bruises and then him looking to the camera to say it's over. Wow, what a, what a, what a, what a, what an experience. <laughs> that was not what I expected. Man, I am so glad I didn't look up who directed this movie before watching it because, man... <laughs> It was such a surprise at the end to see Sam Raimi's names, name in the credits. And it all made sense, like the moment I saw his name, but man, that was hilarious. I think going into this movie, I was just genuinely confused for a while because I probably had some preconceived notions about the style and what to expect in terms of the way that the movie was filmed, the way that it was edited the way that it was acted. I, I definitely had some expectations just based on past Marvel movies that we've seen here on my channel. And all in all, this movie was just way more campy, way more wacky than I was expecting. But the name is Doctor Strange in the Multiverse of Madness. I definitely feel like it lived up to its name. <laughs> Did feel like Alice in Wonderland, like we're all mad here. Definitely felt like a little wacky, a little zany, a little mad. So the name, holds up and now knowing that Sam Raimi directed it it did feel exactly like his Spider-Man trilogy with Tobey Maguire so it really does make sense I just think I couldn't tell what they were doing for a while because it felt like we were bouncing around between this horror camp style action movie Marvel style and this weird zany comedy thing in between. It felt like we were just bouncing back and forth like a pinball between those three styles. And so I was confused for a while. Um, but as it went on more and more and more, I eventually got on board. I think as we got closer and closer to the end, I started having more fun with it, especially when Stephen Strange had to dream walk in his zombie's body because the second I saw that and the hand coming out of the ground, I was like, okay, this is hilarious. I love this. This is reminding me of Hocus Pocus. Like I'm getting Hocus Pocus vibes of when they reanimated Billy and he became a zombie throughout the movie and it was just like this fun little character. That was the vibes I was getting, especially with the book too. There's a whole thing with the book in Hocus Pocus um, with magical powers and books being destroyed and fought over. So I was getting a lot of Hocus Pocus vibes in the end. Um, and I actually feel like this movie would have been really good for Halloween time. 
I'm kind of surprised that they released it when they did. Yeah, this was fun. It was just wild. It was definitely a wild ride. One of the recurring questions is just, are you happy, Steven? Like, are you happy? And I, I do feel like he was happier at the end because America came into his life and he had someone to connect with and was able to like put the past behind him a bit more and move on and fix his watch and like let Christine go uh, because he realized like there's not a single universe where he and Christine worked out. I did like seeing that resolution for his character. He was more fun to watch in this movie and I think he redeemed himself a little bit more in this movie for me because this Doctor Strange and this universe was the only one who was like, I am not going to kill this kid. Like I'm going to protect her. It's the only way. I'm kind of surprised Wong flipped so quickly, to be honest, in that moment. I like getting to see Wanda be a bad bitch, um, but I'm sad that she's gone now because I love her. And I will say that it's really a testament to Elizabeth Olsen as an actress when I am watching this movie that feels so campy, so goofy in the editing transitions and the even some of the moments when actors are turning to camera and winking and making jokes. It is such a testament to her acting prowess that even with all that going on, when there is a moment where she's dropped back in by America to the reality where she is a mother and has children and she sees her children are scared of her because she's hurting their mother and it's this moment of grounded reality. The fact that like she was able to make me feel her pain so quickly and immediately and to feel her sadness and cry with her um, is really just, it's really impressive. Massive props to her as an actor. I think she's just fantastic. Uh, I could watch her all day. It's also a testament to Sam Raimi as a director that this style works for him and he, he does it really masterfully. I will say like there are not many people who could do what he does. It's not necessarily like my favorite style all the time, but the fact that he executes it so well is really impressive. So I did have fun. I think this is definitely a movie I would watch again. I would just go into it with a completely different expectation and a different mindset. I think I went into it with preconceived notions, I will admit that. And it delivered something completely different. I think I just expected it to be similar in tone to the first Doctor Strange. Uh, and it was not. It was not at all. But the art, the art style was similar in ways. Like the landscape art for both the first Doctor Strange and this one are, are incredible. I really liked the world where we met the evil Doctor Strange. I thought the artwork for that was like stunning. But yeah, just some of the moments were so silly. My God. But I would totally watch it again for that reason. I think it'd be fun to rewatch knowing what you're getting yourself into. Um, that's how I felt when I watched the original Spider-Man trilogy with Tobey Maguire. I kind of knew what I was getting myself into because um, I'd already seen the first movie when I watched them on YouTube and I'd heard that they were cheesy and campy. So I was like ready and it was a great time and I really liked them. So... Yeah, I would definitely be down to watch this again. I think it was fun and cute. Definitely some fun cameos that I wasn't expecting. And all in all, it was a good time. I'm definitely curious to hear your guys' thoughts in the comments down below on this reaction. Some of y'all might not have known that I, I don't care for Doctor Strange as a character that much, so I'm interested to see <laughs> what y'all think of, of my thoughts on him. I think I like him a little more now of what he did for the kid America. I will say I like him a little more now. I still don't love him that much. He's fine. He's just fine in my book. I don't know. I still love other characters like Wanda and Loki and Black Widow way more. But let me know what you think. Am I wrong? Do you agree with me? I would love to know your thoughts in the comments down below. And I hope you guys like this video. In the meantime, if you did, I should put this drink down. <laughs> feel weird doing that. All of a sudden, I'm like, wait, what's in my hands? <laughs> if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up because it really helps me out and it lets me know that you guys want to see more content like this. Of course, let me know your thoughts in the comments down below. I would love to know. And of course, write anything that you want me to watch next and subscribe if you want to. Till the next one, stay golden. Bye.